Hello, Paul Hamilton here for iPad Monthly. I think one of the great things that technology can do is actually get kids to open up and actually use the technology as a stimulus to think about or get kids to communicate what's happening in their heads. So one of the things I think that's an ongoing issue in, in schools is obviously getting kids um, with pastoral care to really talk about their feelings, open up, um, for us to get a really good insight into what's happening with kids at home and and kind of be really sympathetic and empathetic towards that. So here's a great little activity for the early childhood sector. Might just kid, get kids opening up and really talking about things that are happening in their lives as a pastoral care. So I'm going to open up uh, Daily Monster, which uh, our kids absolutely love. And what we're actually going to do is, is give kids a little bit of a scenario. So in this case, it is create a monster that kind of reflects something that's good that's happening in your life um, that makes you happy. So I'll hit the little tap here. And you can see there, it's really easy to use. I can move that around with two fingers. I can rotate, that could be his hair. Might make it a little bit smaller. And let's go to the parts of the monster. I might actually bring in, um, what do we do? Should we go to, uh, let's go and actually put a little bit of a, a face on him as well. Let's see if we can get some, we've got lots of different hands. What if we bring in um, this, so we can have our monster actually kind of having presence. And so our kid might have just had a beautiful birthday and you can kind of open that up a little bit if you like. Uh, let's have a look at some kind of faces, see if we've got any faces coming through there. Uh, why don't we start with two eyes? And the great thing about this is kids are starting to actually create their kind of monster a little bit. So I'll make him have really big eyes, which is great. Uh, let's go with a different eye over here. And you can see there that it's really starting to come together and you've got this great little character that's starting to actually develop. And so what we can do there is get kids to actually open up and start to communicate about how they felt and what the, what is the story behind how they're feeling. So why don't we actually, uh, let's actually save that now and see how we can actually go about that. So I'll press the little save button down here. Let's save it straight to our photos. And see how that goes. That looks like it's gone through pretty well. And why don't we jump into another app just so we can communicate it. We'll jump into Book Creator, one of our favorite books, um, sorry, our favorite apps because it's really, really easy to do certain things. And I might put a little heading in here first. Um, I feel happy when, and we'll make that nice and big. Let's hit it, the eye and just make that a little bit bigger there, which is cool. Make that go across, put that up the top. And why don't we then go to our photos and see if we can bring in that photo of our little monster, which looks absolutely awesome. That looks really, really good. And then what we can actually get kids to do is to actually record, uh, maybe add, add a, a, an audio recording there, talking about um, when our little monster's feeling happy, but really it's a stimulus to get kids to open up about how they're feeling at the same time. Um, this is just a great way of using uh, a few different apps, but coming out with a bit of a product at the end. So they've got some skills with it, uh, including adding text, doing a little bit of typing, adding audio, but also the context of this is, is from a pastoral care point of view, getting kids to open up about how they're feeling and getting them to uh, communicate what's happening with their lives that actually has effect on how they're learning in the classroom. So I hope you found that useful. Great little activity, great to do at the start of the year, but also great to do um, on any days or set days throughout the year when you're really focused on um, getting to know each other and actually looking after one another as well. Paul Hamilton here for iPad Monthly, signing off.